Okay guys, so let's get started. I wanted to start off with this NYX Off Tropic Shadow Palette and take that top middle shade. It's like a yellow orange, really pretty bright shade just to brighten up my look because I'm going to be using a gold kind of shadow all over my lids. So it's adding a little bit of color and a little bit of depth into the crease and I feel like that always helps a look feel finished. And then on my brow bone, I'm going to take that top left shade. It's perfect. It doesn't have any shimmer to it, but yet it still highlights the brow bone beautifully and I don't know, I love this shade. It's perfect. Now I'm going to take my Revlon Color Stay Cream Eyeshadow in 710 Caramel. It's this beautiful light gold shade. It was way lighter on my lids than I thought it was going to be. I thought it would be a little bit more coppery um, from what it looked like in the pan, but on my lids you can see it's just a beautiful fall gold and I don't know, it could work with anything. Daytime, nighttime look. It was a great find and I love these colors. Like the color stay shadows, you should definitely invest because they last all day. I've had other colors and I love it. Now for what I was really excited to try, it was this Essence Melted Chrome Eyeliner and this one is in the shade Platinum Beauty. This was awesome. I feel like it was very opaque, but since it has that shimmer, when it hits the light, it doesn't look like it's this dark burgundy shade and it doesn't look like it's close to black yet it still looks super defined. So I feel like this is perfect for daytime outings because you can still look glam and fall-like, I feel like, for this time of season. But it's like a pretty hidden surprise and when people get up close, you can see it really well. So I don't know. I really love this. I think it was a great find. These are only a couple dollars and... It was just a beautiful, beautiful shade and easy to work with. I mean, I can't believe that I swiped once and got it to go across my lid entirely. So that was awesome. Now going back into the NYX Off Tropic palette, I'm taking that purple shade. It has a really pretty sheen to it and I'm just working it from the middle to the outer corner of my bottom lash line just to define it. I'm gonna take the Revlon Color Stay again, the golden shade, caramel, and put that towards the inner corner to the middle and kind of blend that in just to add a little bit of shimmer and lighten it up a bit because I felt like the look came out lighter than I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be way more dramatic, but both that golden shade and the eyeliner were a lot brighter and lighter. So just letting y'all know, it's not super dark, but super pretty nonetheless. Now back in with my Melted Chrome Eyeliner in Platinum Beauty and I'm putting that again on the outer corner. I left some of the purple that we put down but I just wanted to dark in that outer corner a little bit more so it would blend in with the little cat eye that I did. It was a very baby cat eye but it blended in beautifully. Here I am blending it with an actual brush because it is such a precise and thin tip. I wanted to expand it and blend it out a little bit more. Now I'm taking my Maybelline Colossal Volume Express Mascara and applying that to the top and bottom lashes. And overall I gotta say that this look was super easy to do, super pretty. I love how it turned out and I really think that you need the Revlon Color Stay Cream Eyeshadow again in caramel and the Essence Melted Chrome Eyeliner again in Platinum Beauty because they were amazing and I absolutely love how it turned out. Here I am again showing you how much I love them and giving them a thumbs up because I was that impressed at how easy it was to work with. And that's everything for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Here's a close up. I absolutely love how it turned out. And that's everything for me. I will see you guys in the next video. Love you guys. Mwah.